welcome to this uh, shortwave radio channel and uh, this is of course uh, decoding of FT8 a amateur mode that is really just exchanging call signs and uh, grids and location and um, and signal level uh, once again easy to code you don't have to necessarily have a million cables and here I'm just using the Texan PL 330's capability at single sideband. I'm on 7074, which is a FT8 frequency of the 40 meter band. The phone here, which is a Galaxy S9, is simply running the app. No cables, just using the microphone. And even worse than that is that the Texan PL 330 has no external antenna. It's running off telescopic only. And I'm in the kitchen, of course, because here's where I get the le least amount of noise. So what you hear here is the FT8 signals and all the stations calling. And what you see here is the code. So when you see CQ in a different color, it tells you the call sign of the stations and the location. And when you see two call signs, the one on the l the last one is always the one you're listening to. It's simply they're having a contact. So uh, this is kind of cool. Uh, the first number is also the offset from the main frequency. So 7074, but there's several stations here that you hear that have different tones. They are on not exactly on the same frequency. There's an offset in the frequency. So this works really well, and it's a great setup. If you have an Android uh, tablet, if you have an Android phone, you can simply just decode away. Uh, make sure that the uh, FT8 RX delta time here at the bottom is set to zero zero. If it's not at zero zero, you have to either lower or, um, or or make it greater, depending what the time is here, to match zero zero. That's where you'll get the best number of decode of stations. So let's put the volume up and let it decode for a little while. You guys can see what it looks like. So as you can see, this app works really, really well. And it shows you how good a te the Texan PL330 also is as a simple little receiver and single sideband. One of the biggest problems of the old days was that receivers were drifting all the time and there were all sorts of these little problems. Radios today don't drift anymore. They are so rock solid with PLL driven circuits that even cheap radios are rock solid and, and just stay a put on the frequency. So 7074, let's, uh, let's try the 80 meter band frequency, which is uh, 3574, I think. There we go, this is 80 meters. Let's try 80 meters and see how it decodes the 80 meter ones.
works really, really well. And decoding uh, some of the some of the stations. I mean, uh, you could see how well it decodes on all the stations, calling CQ and everywhere. So this is 80 meters. Once again, using only telescopic. So it shows you how the Texan PL330 is an amazing little receiver, and uh, shows you that you know just using an app, no connection, as long as it's quiet. Because if there's a lot of noise around you, it won't work, of course. But if it's quiet. Uh, good enough for FT8. Remember on FT8, the bandwidth, at least 3 kilohertz bandwidth, very important because if you are lower than that, what's going to happen is that bandwidth is going to cut through the frequencies of the audio and you won't hear all the stations. You'll hear only a narrower uh, amount of stations depending on where they're transmitting. Hope you enjoyed this uh, little demonstration. If you do, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.